uh, we will see the uh, selenium history that is selenium versions overview selenium version 1 will it is a combination of selenium ide selenium rc and grid we are not in the necessary to use all the selenium tools together in a single project as per the application or project requirement we can choose the selenium tools among selenium ide selenium rc and selenium web driver or grid etc selenium ide is nothing that is integrated development environment tool it is a firefox plugins we cannot use this tool with the chrome driver or ie driver like that it will work only with the firefox driver it contains inbuilt selenium commands to write enhanced test cases and also allows us to you and also allows us to record edit playback and debug tests it groups or it also can save test as a html ruby scripts or any other format next topic is drawback of selenium ide selenium we can use selenium ide only for small or simple applications we cannot handle our right test cases to test major or complicated functionalities it doesn't have object repository like uft or qtp and also doesn't support data driven keyword driven or pom frameworks it doesn't support any programming languages such as java python perl like that it it supports only firefox browser we can record it we can record the manual actions and the playback it that's it the next topic is selenium rc selenium remote control nowadays this tool is outdated why because a uh, selenium web driver came to place the web driver has some features which overcomes the selenium rc features so we are using the selenium rc for only maintenance projects next topic is selenium grid we are using selenium grid to test cross browser testing parallel testing and group testing generate a uh, html test report using test ng frameworks next uh, topic is selenium version 2 see a combination of selenium ide selenium rc selenium web driver selenium grid what is new to this uh, selenium version 2 selenium web driver it comes next topic is selenium web driver it uses selens and web driver commands to send also object or element locators to write the test cases or enhance the test cases next we will see the features of selenium web driver selenium web driver is used to write test cases enhance test cases using various programming languages such as java python perl ruby php by having the features of selenium web driver we can handle major projects or functionalities it also used various browsers to execute test cases such as firefox chrome ie safari opera but the selenium ide will not support any other browsers except firefox it supports various operating systems like windows unix linux macintosh and it supports data driven keyword driven pom page object model next we will see the drawback of selenium web driver it doesn't create detailed test report it doesn't have object repository like uft or 
QTP. And also, we cannot test window or CUI based applications, command user interface applications. Next topic is Selenium version 3.x. This is the current version. Selenium released two beta versions of Selenium 3.0 with a few of the below changes. For beta 1 updates, the minimum requirement of Java version is now 8 plus. It support for Firefox, supports the Firefox via Mozilla's Jekko driver. Previously, we will, uh, previously in the version, Selenium version 2, we will use Mozilla driver directly uh, but in uh, beta 1 version we will uh, access the firefox via jeco driver we will discuss this later but the next talk is major difference between selenium ide and uh, selenium web driver selenium web driver is typically used to create browser based regression test test cases whereas selenium ide is most advantageous in creating unit test cases exploratory test cases and quick bug reproduction scripts the next step is environment setup for selenium 